April 21st, 2017. Pre-releases. Pre-releases. Everywhere. No, seriously, everywhere. It's gonna get a bit drafty in here. Wanna play a game? One down, three to go. It's time to get your game on at our next big Games Day event. Let the games begin. We missed a deadline. Oops. And a box opening video coming soon. All this and more on this week's edition of Leisure Time Games Presents. Hi everyone, I'm the Ken, and welcome to this week's edition of Leisure Time Games Presents the Weekly Update, the weekly vlogcast where we talk about things happening soon here at Leisure Time Games and maybe even a game store near you. Now, I'm not going to lie, folks, it's been a busy couple of weeks. That's why you didn't get to see my usual weekly vlogcast update. There just wasn't enough time to get in front of the camera and update the YouTubes. So, this week I decided to do the update on the vlogcast first, then I'll do all the other updates after. So if you go to some of the links down below and they're not working yet, give me a day or two, and I should have those updated real soon. And now our top story, the Amon Ket pre-release weekend. This is a quick update for those of you who may have been caught unaware. This weekend, April 22nd and 23rd, Leisure Time Games will be hosting six pre-release tournaments for the latest Magic the Gathering set, Amon Ket. We still have some special pricing slots available, but they are filling up quick. If you'd like more information, there will be a link in the description section below. Speaking of pre-releases... We're hosting another Pokemon pre-release. On Saturday, April 29th, we're holding a pre-release for the latest Pokemon set, Sun and Moon, Guardians Rising. The last pre-release sold out, so we got twice as many kits this time. The slots for this event are filling up fast, so if you're interested, you better sign up soon. And now, back to Amon Ket. On April 28th through April 30th, Leisure Time Games will be hosting draft events for the Amon Ket Draft Weekend. Starting Friday, anytime there's eight or more players, and during Friday Night Magic, We'll be drafting the latest set for Magic the Gathering, Amon Ket. The events continue through the weekend at 11.30 a.m. and 3.30 p.m. Everyone who participates will get a special foil promo, Oracle's Vault. And now, International Tabletop Day. International Tabletop Day is April 29th. On that day, Leisure Time Games will be opening up its shop for you, so you can come on in and have a good time. Come on in any time between 10 a.m. and 8 p.m., bring a game, bring a friend, and have a good time. If you'd like more information about International Tabletop Day, there will be a link to their website in the description section below. On to Grand Prix Trial Omaha. As if the 29th didn't already have enough going on, we've got yet another event. We'll be hosting one of the final store-level Grand Prix trials for the card game Magic the Gathering. This tournament will feed the Grand Prix Omaha. The format for this tournament will be standard with a rule enforcement level of regular. Deck listing will begin at 11, the player meeting will be at noon, and round one will follow immediately after. Now as if the 29th didn't have enough going on, Wait until you see May the 6th. On May the 6th, Leisure Time Games will be hosting its second of five annual events, Con de Mayo. Our Games Day events usually have plenty going on, but this one's extra special. It happens to coincide with Free Comic Book Day, an international event that Leisure Time Games will be a part of. We'll also be hosting a special Star Wars cosplay event, May the 4th, Revenge of the 5th. It also happens to be the Cinco de Mayo weekend, but I'll leave that up to you and how you're going to celebrate that. On to the Amonkhet Magic League. <laughs> it's 
Starting on Tuesday, May the 2nd, and every Tuesday through May 23rd, Leisure Time Games will be hosting the Amonkhet Magic League. Come on in any time between 5 p.m. and 8 p.m., pick up three boosters, and build a 30-card deck. We'll even have a special Amonkhet deck box to give you so you can store your decks and your extra cards in. Over the course of the league, you can purchase extra booster packs to change up your deck. Play whoever you want, earn points, and at the end of the league, we'll have special promotional four-sided dice to give away. The full rules to the event will be on our website. And now, an event we won't be hosting. Yeah, we kind of missed a deadline. On April 29th and 30th, Leisure Time Games will not be hosting a sneak peek for the latest Yu-Gi-Oh! set, Maximum Crisis. You will not be able to enter for $20. You will not receive five Maximum Crisis boosters, a set checklist, or a special promo card. You also will not be able to enter for your chance to win a special Maximum Crisis playmat. Oops. And now, you box opening game fans. After this weekend's Amonkhet pre-release, if we have any leftover product, we're going to play the box opening game. The box opening game 2.0 Retailer Edition is a new way to play and was created by yours truly. We open a box, we record the results, just like the regular game, but we add a layer or two. Want to know more? Keep an eye out for the video coming out next week. And now, this week's Achievement Unlock. The Time Machine. To unlock this week's achievement, watch previous episodes of the weekly update, then leave comments in the comment section to show you were there. So that's it for this week's episode. If you'd like to know more about Leisure Time Games, you can find that on our website, leisuretimegames.com. If you liked today's video, click the like button. If you have any questions, comments, or ideas you'd like to share, leave those in the comment section. Don't forget to subscribe, and if you would be so kind, please share. Tune in next week when we go over full details of our next Big Games Day event, we give away a part of your childhood, and we finally tell you what Listerine was originally used for. See you then. Peace.